Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Mike and I will be your instructor for this course. I've been a 3D artist for about 10 years now and my beginning into the 3D modeling world was walking over to a bookshop in the UK and purchasing and reading through a now rather old learning 3ds max 2010 book which means that all my knowledge and skills have been self-taught i'm best described as an indie game developer and character artist but most of my 3d modeling time is spent providing indie developers and studios around the world with 3d characters for their video game projects through my freelance opportunities i was very happy and fortunate to be approached by yihu to create and provide this course to you in said course my goal is to show you the power of iterative design along with some of its slightly annoying counterparts on how to build a 3D game ready character from a base mesh to in engine and ready to go for games. We'll start off by discussing how to gather references and I'll even spend some time showing you my truly not so brilliant style of concept art but it gets the job done and discussing other design ideas then we'll throw our base mesh character into Marvel's designer to start fashioning the clothing after which we'll jump backwards and forwards from Maya and Zebrush to sculpt our base meshes and our character to a high fidelity and I'll take you through retopologizing the game ready mesh from the high poly, baking textures and then jumping over to substance painter to create our game ready textures. Finally, we'll make the jump into Unreal to make sure all our materials are working out nicely for us and we'll round the course up with a quick crash course on rigging and skinning ready for in-game use and animation. So for those of you out there who are quite familiar with the software, and who would like to try what I believe to be a rather unorthodox yet powerful approach to character design and modeling, come along and experience a less simple journey from A to B, but truly embracing the power of being in control of our designs and being unafraid to make changes as we go along. I look forward to seeing you all inside.